recovery, but it'll still take a, a couple, a month or two. Uh, so continue to pray for them. And uh, there is a meal train meet there, so if you can help out, um, it's greatly re reduced, but there is a meal train need there, so if you can help out with that, you know, you know, but contact Kathy Davis, and uh, she'll put you to work. Um, let's see, and we had, uh, there was a well-attended uh, funeral service for Ray Hendrickson yesterday. And uh, Norma Jean is with us this morning, and you can continue to lift up Norma Jean as she has, you know, the loss of her husband. So um, we are glad to know that he is with um, his Creator, our God, our Savior. Um, but still, uh, Norma Jean is at a loss, and so we need to lift her up in prayer and just continue to minister to her. Um, Kim Wagner has had great results with her uh, cancer treatments and uh, is scheduled for a surgery on august 19th so she would ask she's asked prayer for uh, specifically for um, expertise in that procedure and um, a recovery and protection from infection and things so um, on august 19th she will go to virginia mason for um, surgery and we have others too you know uh, dennis sweat is continues to battle cancer and uh, jeff raven has finished his treatments and there are others i'm sure but those are the ones that are on our list this morning um, we need to remember to lift one another up in prayer. And um, let's see, this morning, right after services, we have a baptismal service. And it's over at Rodeo Hall. If you haven't been there before, you can caravan with somebody or, or um, hitch a ride with somebody. And you'll need your fish pass, your fishing spot pass, or discovery pass, I think. But, um, but the trail down to the baptism hole is a little bit narrow, and if you haven't been there before, it's rocky and loose, and the vegetation around it is uh, uh, well infested with poison oak. So don't let your kids go running around picking berries. They'll come back uh, a mess. And, and uh, anyway, so, but right after church, uh, we have a baptismal for Hayden Ryber, and uh, that's what's going on. Okay, so I think I got everything. Let's, let's pray and ask God's blessing on this morning's service. Father in heaven, we thank you again this morning to be able to gather uh, in your name as your people, as your children, um, to celebrate, to uh, praise you, to glorify you, to bring our cares before you, because you are our great, glorious, one and only, true and living God. And um, you are the same yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Our circumstances may change, but uh, you will love us, and uh, you have a plan for us. Your promises will not uh, be denied, and our future is secure in nothing less than you. 
And so we are here today to declare that, to praise you and glorify you, to thank you for your love for us, uh, to sing your praises, to hear your word preached, and bring our cares and concerns, and praise you for our blessings before you. Father, we ask a blessing on Pastor Mike this morning as he has prepared your message. Grant uh, every word would be uh, from you and that our hearts and minds would be open to receive the message you have prepared for each one here. Uh, we thank you, Father, um, that we can read your word, that we have your word, we have your Holy Spirit to minister to each one. Uh, we have all of history and all of the prophets and all of... Uh, your word and the Holy Spirit to minister to us. What more do we need? Nothing. Uh, help us to remember that our eternity is secure, that we need to focus on you, keep our, have our eyes to open heavens for redemption draws nigh. Um, uh, these circumstances we may find ourselves in are temporary. Life here on earth is temporary, and we look forward to the day when you, have, you come and uh, complete our redemption complete our transformation, and we will be like you in the twinkling of an eye, for we will see you as you are. And so, Father, we look forward to that, and until then, we ask that you minister to us, grant our every need, and we will give you the praise and glory for it. Father, we want to lift up our nation, we want to lift up our leaders, uh, especially those who um, uh, declare you and are standing for you, that they would not grow weary, that you would give them strength, that you would give them endurance, the, and they would persevere uh, as they stand on, uh, for truth and they stand for you. Um, Father, we um, ask that you would uh, use our leaders for your purposes, that they would be seeking uh, you for uh, wisdom. Um, we ask a special blessing on our missionaries. Some are abroad and not in a safe place. And we ask for their protection, your mercy and grace and protection on them as they minister to those who do not know you. They are a bright and shining light in a dark space. And Father, they are uh, doing everything for your people. And so uh, we pray for them. Father, we ask your blessing on this morning. Uh, we trust you completely for all of our needs. And we'll give this time back to you in Jesus' name.
the seed I've received I will sow. I will bring praise, I will bring praise. No weapon formed against me shall remain. I will rejoice, I will declare. God is my victory and He is here. I will bring praise, I will bring praise. No weapon formed against me shall remain. I will rejoice, I will declare. God is my victory and He is here. God is my victory and He is here. Children, if you want to go over here, Children's Church, you're dismissed to go over there. <laughs> 